It began with 15 television hosts, but after eight weeks of grueling competition, only two are left vying for the coveted endorsement of one man. I know you've both worked very, very hard for this title. I only wish there could be two winners today. Once Lex and Chevy Chase were eliminated, I knew I had it pretty much in the bag. I mean, let's face it, Chip's an emotional basket case, and uh, it pretty much always shows up at least half drunk. When you go out there and sit on the purple couch, you have a responsibility to the audience. This is not a game. But then there was a whole news update contest. Apparently taking umbrage at this remark, Ed Porter hit back, saying, it's not the size of the training. It was totally rigged. One will be eliminated, and one will receive the most important career boost imaginable. Your opening gag, it was uh, amusing, but uh, everybody could tell you were reading your script. Clearly you didn't prepare for the interview. You were just going through the motions out there. Frankly, as a viewer, I was insulted. You know, we all really get to know each other and get really close after a few weeks, and every time somebody was eliminated, it was like we lost a family member. And now it's down to me and Jeff. And I know we had some difficulties. You drink the last of the milk? Regional Transportation Commission. Guacamole. Human Genome Project. I really think we've all grown quite a bit. I'm okay. This last round was very much the hardest for me. I've gotten to know both these contestants. I really just have not been looking forward to this moment. This is very, very difficult. Don't miss the exciting season finale. The Endorsement with Fred Keeley. You're endorsed. <laughs>